Hey guys, early afternoon. It's Elsa the Bargain Hunting Crafter. I am here today as I join along the collaboration for Tag Along With Us, uh, hosted by Annie Creates and Martha Hamilton, Hamilton over at Granny's House. Um, it's it's uh, tags that we're creating for any occasion, any kind of tags. Um, it's being done every Wednesday up until October 6th. If I'm not mistaken, October, October 6th, yeah. Um, it's an open collaboration. Everyone's welcome to join and participate. I am having fun. This is the second week. And um, I actually am being on top of things and, uh, and doing my best to um, participate. So I wanted to come on and show you guys what I created. But first, I want to show you guys the materials that I used. Um, for the tags themselves, this time, even though I have a lot of tags, if you watch week one, of my tags, you would have seen that I had I have a bunch of tags, guys. All kinds of tags. But this time around, I wanted to do something different and not use the tags that I have and be a little bit more creative. So what I did was I used my card stock, my paper stock, whatever it's called. And I used the pink one with the glitter. I like this paper because it doesn't flake. Um, I used the orange one. And I used a black one. I don't think I have any... Uh, regular size black one so I use a 12 by 12 so I just cut it down the um down down in the half and use four made four with the black because I had more black so that's the paper that I used for the ribbon on each tag I used um my ribbon my strips of ribbon this was gifted to me by uh Gina loves to craft craft and Trina's place they both had gifted me ribbon and um, I've already bagged it up and everything because I have everything sorted out in my um, bins. So this is one of the bags of the many that they both gifted me. Thank you, ladies. So um, this is the tags that I use. And um, I used, because I had hauled so many of the um, Halloween stickers from Dollar Tree, I said, you know what, I'm going to go ahead and use them. So I used three different packs for three different sets of um, tags. Um, this is the 12-piece. It's that one. As you can see, I used all the stickers on that. And I saved it because if you look closely, the leaves and stuff, they're not stickers, but I'll be fussy cutting them so that I can use them. Thought those were cute. Um, I used this one with the pink and uh, pink, hot pink and orange pumpkins. I didn't use all of these because they had some bigger stickers. So I used the bigger stickers because the tag was bigger. And then this one was the same thing. I This one's a 17 piece, by the way. And then I used this 15 piece, which is also Halloween. And this is more on the orangey side, which is why I grabbed the orange paper. So for this one, I, I used the pink paper. This one, I used the orange one. And this one, of course, I used the black one. So those are the three items that I use. And I also use my corner punches for some of them. Um, and my uh, scissors, which I don't know. I think I left that over there. Sorry. So, yeah, that's the packs of stickers that I use in the ribbon and the card, the paper that I use. So, first, let me show you the pink one. These were a little bit bigger. And as um, so you can see, I used the corner punch in the bottom for so all four corners. If I put my hand, yeah, you can see it better there. And these are the stickers that I used from, uh, where is that, from this pack. I used the boo sticker with the ghost. This one's pretty simple. I thought this came out really cute. It's pretty big, but that's okay because it's Halloween. I figured if I put some sort of pocket in the back, maybe, um, with the leftover paper that I have from this sheet, maybe put a pocket, like trim the border. I should have done that, but, and maybe put some stickers or some goodies in there. You never know. So I left it blank. So this that one. And then also with the, oh, here's the ribbons. I got to tighten it up a little bit. Here's a ribbon that I used. Also with the pink, I used the same sticker pack. And I added the bat, the spider, and some pumpkins. And the, and the stars that were there. Thought that came out really cute. And then for the orange. I don't know, I, I, you know, oranges, that's a, that's a um, Halloween color. As you can see, it's all Halloween themed. Um, and I really liked the sticker pack that I use. So this is the stickers and the pack that came with this one. Was it this one? No, that's the pink one. 
I'd be so lost, guys. <laughs> this is the sticker pack. And these are the stickers that I used. I love I Heart Halloween, which I do. I gotta find, there's more stickers over there. I gotta put something in this corner. It just seems so bare. And I used orange and black ribbon, as you can see. Same corner punch on this one. Thought that one came out really cute. I just gotta find another sticker or something to put there. Once again, these tags are bigger, so I'll probably put a, a pocket in the back just to give it some, some design in the back. <laughs> same sticker pack. Same corner punch, same paper, and this one just has the orange uh, ribbon, and I put, let me get that out of the way, I put, I put a spell on you, trick or treat, the cool ghost, the skeleton, and the bat in the middle. Some of these stickers are three-dimensional, and I thought this one came out really cute, too. So I did that one, and then for the black one, black is my favorite color, aside from red. Red is my all-time favorite color. I'm not going to lie. Um, I use the I Love Being Witchy. So this is what the tags that look like. Every corner on these tags, some, some are different than others. This one says I Love Being Witchy with the purple flower, the bat. I think this one came out really, really cute. Same thing in the back. Blank. And this one says Happy Halloween and um, Happy Haunting. I love that black rose. Look at that. Isn't that cute? Look at that spider. Love it. And then this one is with the skeleton. This one says boo. And then it has a potion bottle and a skeleton with the with the um bones. Thought that one came out really cute too. And then the ribbon on this one's a little bit different. This one has, so if you look at this one, it has that striped. And but this one has an eyelid in purple. To coordinate with the purple so does the other one so i did that one and then this ribbon is a little bit different as you can see and then this one pretty simple as well the corners were used with the scissors the crafting scissors which i think i left in the in the in the living room so i thought that was really cute i put the court the spider in the corner bats flying over the moon the skull I thought this one came out really, really cute. So that is all that I made. It was a total of eight tags. And I had fun doing it, guys. I had fun. And as you can see, it's all Halloween themed. Um, I'm trying to make every set of tags different. Um, as my mind, as I wake up, my mind starts to roll with it. And I thought Halloween. So that's what I went for. And um, I'm already working... My mind is already working on some ideas for next week's tags, but we'll see what happens. So guys, make sure there is, um, if you hit the hashtag, that says hashtag tag along with us. If you click on that, you will be able to see the playlist of everyone participating in the collab. So make sure to go over and check it out. Annie, Granny, thank you very much for hosting this collab. And I'm looking forward to watching everybody's um, videos. Take care. Oh, by the way, I will be back. I do have... Uh, the announcement for the giveaway winners. All right, guys, stay tuned.